Hey everyone, it's Mark from Memory Lane Transfers. It's been a while since our last post, but we're excited to be back. And let me tell you, we have a lot of content coming your way. What I want to go over in this is that you know a little bit about the video transfers we do, but we also do film restoration. This is uh, a subject that I've always been fascinated by, and I decided some time ago to dive into it and see how we could make film um, how to get the dust and scratches out and how, you know, and not just have, how to explain it. You know, we see how beautiful Hollywood does their restorations. Well, why can't we have that for our precious memories uh, to do? Now, we don't do 16 millimeter and 8 millimeter and super 8 millimeter on premises. We don't. At this time, we don't do that. We do have a company we've partnered with and they do a beautiful 1080p transfer of your precious film we've been dealing with them for quite a few years and uh, they do a spectacular job we then go to the next step if you care this is an upgraded service if you do care to upgrade and you want to do um film restoration on your precious family moments uh that's where we come in and uh, we show you what we can do and what we can make it look like so let me go ahead and show you some samples. This is 16 millimeter film uh, from approximately 1963, I believe, or 64. But if we're talking just 63, um, that makes this film 60 years old. It is 16 millimeter film, and this is directly the way it was transferred over. You could see, you know, for 16 millimeter and for 60 years old, it lasted, it did pretty well. Um, considering but you do have artifacts you do have dust you do have those scratches and that has to do with part of the film decaying um, it's not made to last forever but when we put our restoration process in this is now what we have so here we go we have the same film and as you can see the film is no longer shaky we've stabilized it We've also been able to remove any scratches, um, dust, things that were in it. We've maintained the speed so that you could see exactly how it was supposed to be uh, presented. And we've gone ahead and done this. I mean, this looks like it was filmed yesterday. You would not think that this was 60 years old. Um, and this is what I'm talking about. This is just preserving your family memories so that they're fantastic to look at without losing that nostalgia feel with it. Here we are now. We could see side by side um, the difference. Um, you could see on the left side is the original and you could see all the dust, all the dirt, um, the shaky footage. And then you could see once we've gone ahead and gone in, once we go in there and do what we do, the it's just um, a much better image. It's better to to watch, and it's restoring and being presented in the way that our ancestors wanted us to view this. Just because age has come on a memory doesn't mean that we can't still watch it in the way that it was supposed to be presented to us um this is definitely much more um visually pleasing to the eye to watch uh than anything else let me show you another example this was 16 millimeter film from again about 1963 let me show you another one here okay this is super 8 film and this is from 1967 uh, you could see this is also aged. It's, it's lasted through the test of time. You know, we are talking 50 years old. Um, this footage, 55 years old. Um, but there's a lot of dust, dirt, scratches. And you know, no matter how well you store this film, it, it, it's still 50 plus years old. There's only so much um, that it could stay, you know, before before it starts decaying and all this stuff is not going to stay forever it's just not going to so here's a sample of that now let's go ahead and uh, see the restored uh, version and keep in mind uh, this has only been the footage you're watching has no color restoration in it this is still the color that was in the film 
Um, there's been no color restoration, nothing else. All that's been done on the film that you're gonna watch is the removal of all the dirt and all the scratches um, and to just make it you know, a bit more pleasurable to, to view. Here's the restored version now. Let me tell you, there we go. You can see now all the dirt, everything has been taken away. All the scratches have been eliminated. Um, and I wanted to show these two different types of restorations because there is a difference with the 16 millimeter and the eight. But again, you cannot put a price on restoring your memories, making them look this vivid, this beautiful, this gorgeous. We haven't even touched color. We haven't even done it, but in personally, in this case, it wasn't even needed. Um, you could personally tweak something and make something a bit more vibrant. Um, but again, just by removing the dirt, um, the artificial artifacts from the image, you could see how much better, how much nicer um, it is to watch and that you would be able to review this and go over it with families. Uh, family members and just show them and just say how cool this time was in this gorgeous vivid uh, timepiece here they are now side by side you could clearly see um, the dust and scratches and dirt um, getting eliminated with the original being on the left and the restored version being on the right now um, I don't believe we did even um, stabilization on this one. I don't think it was necessary. But you could see here um, how visually different it is. And I, I hope for uh, the sake of this video that some of you are watching this video via the YouTube app on your TVs. Because you that's really where you're going to see the difference. Because that's our intention is for you to watch it clearly on TV, not on a computer monitor so that's really where you're gonna see uh, this difference not just in I mean it's just night and day and I'm sure if you watch this video on uh, TV you'll understand exactly what I'm talking about um, those dust and scratches take away so much from what this used to look like and now how gorgeous it is um, on today's technology so that you can share it um, look right here with the dust and dirt with the ferris wheel compared to the next one that's over it's it's just you know unspeakable and there you have it and this is just one of the added services we do here at memory lane transfers and i want you to remember you know we put our best foot forward and, and we treat your videos and your films as if they were our own um and that's the whole point these big box companies don't they hire people work on an hourly wage they're told what to do and if a tape doesn't look good or something doesn't go through right they put a red sticker on it and send it on its way they don't even try it. we don't do that we try everything and this restoration is part of our commitment to making everything as pristine as possible um, and incidentally like I said in that video and we're going to discuss it in an upcoming video topic maybe in the next topic or two but how do we share all this well we have come up with that solution we have come up because it's not only preserving it's sharing right you once you get these memories transferred you're going to want to share them with the next person so how do you do that when it's only on a usb well <laughs> we have the solution and uh, you're going to see it in the next video and that is going to just change the game on how you share memories with your family so until then thank you for your time thank you for watching the video and we'll see you on the next video